What's cracking, everybody? Rob Hunter back with the trendy things that are going on in the news. You haven't seen me in a while because I've been on an Italian vacation. I know you all wanted to know that, but no, literally, I've been on an Italian vacation. Trendy item number one, not my vacation, a girl named Erin Cox. The story of Erin Cox proves how stupid America is, mostly our school system. See, Erin was called by a friend to go pick her up. This friend was at the party getting her drank on, and Erin, who doesn't drink, said, all right, I'll come pick you up. Problem is, the police showed up, busted everybody at the party, including Erin, who wasn't drunk. The officer vouched for her sobriety, but nonetheless, Erin still was suspended by her volleyball team for five games and lost her captaincy. Yes, thank you, North Andover High School in Massachusetts, for proving how dumb we all are as Americans. She did the right thing. She shouldn't face any punishment. Trendy item number two, Banksy. Banksy's an artist, an artist I've never heard of, but then again, the only artists I've ever heard of are named Michelangelo and Raphael. No, not because of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But anyways, Banksy's trying to sell his street art in Central Park, New York City. People are walking by, not even knowing who he is. Some of his art sells for hundreds of thousands of dollars. He was selling it for 60 bucks. I think three people bought artwork and everyone else just walked by, proving a lot of things. Yes, Americans are not only stupid, we know nothing about art, and that's just fine with me. Would have been cool to pick up a piece for 60 bucks worth a couple hundred thousand dollars, though. Brings us right up to trendy item number three with the same theme, Americans are stupid, the government shut down. All right, I think the best way to sum up what happened with the government shutdown is the stenographer. You know, the one that went off the rails while the House was voting to reopen the government. She started talking about the United States Constitution and we're not a nation of God-fearing citizens because the nation was founded by Freemasons. Lady, all you're doing is proving that everyone who works in Congress is nuts. No. It would not have been. Constitution would not have been written by Freemasons. They go against God. You cannot serve two masters. You cannot serve two masters. Praise be to God, Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, that's just enough of government shutdown. Yay, the Grand Canyon's open. Yay, the government's open. Yay, they're continuing to screw us. Awesome. Welcome back to America, Rob. What a day. All right, I got to get out of here. There's only so much stupidity that I can take. My name's Rob Hunter. We'll do the trendy topics again next week right here on KTAR.com. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Heroes in a Half Shell.